Hey beauties, Katie here, and today I'm bringing you a little haul, and this is from Candy Blossom Cosmetics. Um, Candy Blossom is an indie cosmetics company. I will leave the links to their Facebook page and their store envy. No, it's Etsy. It's an Etsy page, not store envy. Sorry. I will leave the links to their Facebook and their Etsy page down below. And I'm going to go ahead and cut into this little envelope of stuff. These envelopes are my worst nightmare. They never want to open well. There we go. Okay. First things first. I'm the realist, apparently. Um, yeah. Just my little order sheet. Don't need that. Because I know what I ordered. And all these come packaged really nicely in bubble wrap. That way that they don't get damaged. And here we go. And... Ooh. Okay. So here's their little card. It's Candy Blossom Cosmetics. And it's so cute. It's got a little cupcake. And the owner is Brenda Ortiz. There we go. Etsy shop and uh, email. Hopefully that's in focus. If not, all this will be down in the description box below as well. And uh, let's see here. Which colors do I want to show first? Whoa. Okay. Um, I ordered a little set and I think this is the set. I think. Um, let me actually refer to that. Um, it's the Summer Mattes Collection Mineral Eyeshadows. Oh, I forget which colors is in the set. I think this is the whole set though. Um, it's Tickle Me Pink, um, Blues Matter, Fickle Violet, and matte me mint and all of them come in these little jars I believe they are five gram jars and all of these are vegan um, matte me mint blues matter both of these are not lip safe the other two fickle violet and tickle me pink are lip safe Okay, so let's go ahead and look at the packaging. This is the little packaging. She's got her little stickers on the top. And opening these. They're all sealed with little sifters. So, there's that. Um, I guess I will do a separate haul, a separate video on these. Um, to where I open them all up and swatch them. Right now, I'm just going to tell y'all all the colors I got and about them. So, there's that set. And then I just got um, a few single eyeshadows of hers as well. I got Purple Rain, and this one is not vegan, and it is lip safe. It's a nice, darker, um, reddish purple, and a lot of these other ones that I got, they are iridescent shades. So that's definitely, I'm going to do the swatch video for y'all. That way I can get real up close and show y'all all the iridescence and the shifting in the colors. So there's that one, Purple Rain. I got Ivy League, which is vegan and lip safe. It's a nice um, kind of camo green. I got That's Amore. It's vegan and it is lip safe. Um, in the tub, this reminds me kind of a little, like a lighter version of Max Blue Brown, but I know it doesn't look like blue brown out of the jar because I've seen swatches of it, so I can't wait to swatch it myself. The next one I have is Tangerine Dream. It is not vegan, but it is lip safe. It's a nice orangey color. It's really nice and light. Next one I have is Undercover. 
and it's another blue one um, this one is vegan and it's not lip safe it's nice and blue and of course like I said it's iridescent I believe this one does a purple iridescence or a red iridescent to it and then the last one I got is enchanted forest it's vegan and it is not lip safe and that's the color there Hopefully y'all can kind of tell what these colors look like with them having the little um, tab over the sifter. Like I said, as I keep saying, I've repeated myself, what, three or four times now. I will do a swatch video with these, so be on the lookout for that. And I'm really happy with this haul that I have. I love the packaging. It's really nice and sturdy. And I love her little stickers and just the packaging and the labeling in general is awesome and this was very very fast shipping these things they're handmade these things this makeup is handmade and it's made in really small batches and it's just it's awesome to get to order from these indie companies and start trying them out and they're a really nice alternative to higher end brands because they do tend to be on the cheaper side of things and you can get a lot of things for a lot less than you can higher brands and most of the time you get a lot higher quality. So I hope y'all like this little haul. Make sure to go check out Candy Blossom Cosmetics. All those links will be in the description box below. Also don't forget to like this video if you like my haul videos. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. The subscribe button is down there. Don't forget to hit it, help my channel grow, and go follow me on all my social media sites, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and Tumblr. All of them are Cupcake Creations. Links will be in the description box below, and I hope y'all have a great day, and I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye!